Welcome everybody, I appreciate you joining me on this one. I have a really cool item that I want to show you guys and this video is sponsored by Flexiboom. And what Flexiboom is, is it's a, it's basically just a data company and what they did is they created different size SIM cards. Uh, you can pay uh, on a plan, it's just a prepaid SIM card is what it is. And the neat thing about it is that it can go in lots of different devices. You can put it in phones, you can put it in cameras such as this one that I have right here that they also sent me. It's a prepaid plan and depending on the requirements of your device, there are no overage fees. Just simply insert the SIM card into your IoT device. There's no activation and you can check your data usage at any time. You can connect to any unlocked IoT device um, regardless if it's a solar camera, a trail camera, or a smart security device. Now what this is going to do is this is going to create a lot of opportunities for you guys that um, may not want to pay these super high monthly or quarterly or yearly plans with these uh, cell cam companies that have cellular cameras. Um, but this is uh, a cheaper way to have your, your own cell camera and it's also a cheaper way to set up your own uh, security system at your home, office, anywhere. Uh, it's re really a cool thing. Now this camera that I'm using here is a real link camera. This is the Go BT Plus. This video is not about this particular camera. It is about the SIM card, which I'm gonna show you guys here in just one second. This thing is super simple. It was so simple, in fact, that I didn't even record uh, the setting up process. And I didn't do an unpackaging either because it just was gonna make this video super duper long. But this Flexiboom sends you your package. It comes in uh, basically just a little card. You pop it out and you select which size card you want. There's the, the biggest one, which is just like your standard SIM size, uh, and you have the sizes all the way down to micro SD, which is what I'm using in this real link camera right here. Don't mind the cows in the background. But you simply just pick your size after you order it. You test it, obviously you wanna make sure that your, power, your device is powered off and your antenna is connected. Insert the SIM card, turn your device on, and this does the rest. Now your device will either tell you whether you're connected or not, what do you think you're doing? I have absolutely nothing to feed you. And this corner is not for you. Get out of here. <laughs> it's easy, it's fast, and it's safe. And if you're having problems getting a device to connect and work the way that you, uh, the way that it's supposed to work, there's simple troubleshooting steps on their website. Very, very simple and easy to, to do. Now I just take the SIM card. Um, like I said, there's no setting up that I did whatsoever. I just, I, uh, they sent me this. They pre-activated and uh, prepaid the plan for me, which would be the same thing that you would do. Then once you receive it, you put the SIM card in the direction that it's supposed to go. If I can do this without, there we go. Close it up, and now um, all I have to do now is power it up. Which there's a power button right here on the back side. And guys, you can uh, you can get any kind of security camera, anything that uh, has an antenna that works like this, uh, any kind of trail camera. Uh, if you get a, like a good deal on cell cameras somewhere where somebody's selling some old cell cameras that they don't particularly care for, like for me personally, I was running uh, like six or seven spy point cell cams and when I got them they were like 100 bucks a piece and I ran them for all of, I don't know, six months to a year and the entire time I had problems, the biggest issues. And it had to do with Spy Point's uh, cellular plan and the way that their service works. And with the way that Flexiboom is designed, you're going to have the best and fastest and most reliable service in your area. So that makes these cell cameras a whole lot more reliable. And in fact, I think I'm going to be able to actually put some of those Spy Points back into use with these uh, uh, SIM cards. I'm just just changing a network is all I'm doing really. All that said, let's get back to the regular portion of this video. Hope that you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna film a quick intro. Yeah. We just got in. It's okay, it's okay if she's on a video. Okay, so we, uh, we're here at the Real McCoy Ranch and we are covered up in literally everything. It's a, a fantastic evening, a little bit warm, but we're covered up in a, a little bit of uh, everything, as I said, from fallow to hogs, all dead. Neil got 
Texas, Black Buck, you name it, uh, we're covered up in it right now, but I have one of my very good friends, Mr. John, right here, and he brought his granddaughter with him, say hi, <laughs> hi everybody, so we, uh, I'm not in the, the shooter seat tonight, thank goodness, John is, so um, we're after a little bit of everything, whatever uh, comes out, kind of focusing on a ram's lamb, maybe, uh, but there's a new guy bull down there. Looking really good, and a really good whitetail buck right there. You see that whitetail buck? A really nice whitetail buck. So, we're, uh, we're covered. I'm gonna make this quick, cut it short, cut it quick. If you guys wanna hunt the Rumble Coy Ranch, all the information's down in the description below. But let's pop down. I'm gonna show you guys some animals. Let's get to it. After John shot that bull, we decided it would be best if we gave him plenty of time. And in doing that, we came in, had a quick dinner, gave that uh, bull about, I don't know, I'd say somewhere in the neighborhood of about two hours, and went back out. And what we found uh, is pretty awesome. Can't wait for you guys to see this bull. We're tracking blood. We just had dinner of fajitas and zebra, courtesy of John. And now we're looking for Neil Guy. We're on some pretty good blood, but uh, we're working our way in, coming to a spot where he kind of may or may not have turned and gone multiple different directions. We're trying to figure that out right now. But we are on the track after dinner, and we're excited. Hopefully, be showing you guys the big bull here in just a minute. You still got it? You still got it, dude? Oh my goodness! Whoa. Look at the body on that dude. <laughs> That's his exit right there. Wow. I wouldn't have expected that ever. No, it had to hit a ribbon kick. Huh? Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I thought it would have came out like right here. Yes, that's exactly where I would have thought too. He was kick, mule kicking. Yeah. He had a little bite in the back leg. And with the, died, the amount of blood that's coming out of there, it looks like femoral. Well, he did run back toward the water, didn't he? Yes, he did. And I saw him. He was laying on the side. And I saw yes, he did. And I was like, oh, look at this. This is and I, and I started getting a little bit closer, and I see those little white boobies on it. And I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> okay. There he is. All right. You slide okay. devil, you. Dude, give him a kid. You found him. You give him a kiss first. I'll do it. You give him a kiss first. Oh, boys. He stinks too. Yeah, he 
does. Look at that dark bull. Y'all do good work. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, we definitely need a tractor for this run. <laughs> They're way bigger in person, aren't they? Yeah, they are. <laughs> Man, that's gonna taste good, isn't it? Yes, it is. As I'm sure many of you know, Neil Guy is fantastic eating, and I know John's gonna really enjoy his bull. He laid down a lot of animals this weekend. So there's going to be lots of videos coming from the Real McCoy Ranch. I can't wait to share those videos with you guys. John was after his Ram Slam this past weekend. And he just about completed it with the exception of one sheep. And that is a mouflon. And man, we were close to closing the deal and sealing the deal on that mouflon. But it's just going to have to wait until his next trip. But I'm super excited for him. And like I said, he had a fantastic weekend of slinging arrows and those are going to be coming out in the next week or so but before i go i want to say a huge thank you to flexi boom for sending over the the sim card as well as the camera system and i can't wait to be using this more often this is going to be an awesome tool to go in my tool bag toolbox whatever you want to call it and this is going to help me to really pin down and locate some animals a little bit better i don't know about you guys i've never had cell cameras that are made uh, by actual trail camera companies that have been 100% reliable all the time. It's amazing that there's technology like this today. And since we have it, I want you guys to check it out. Links will all be down in the description below. I want you guys to check out the Flexiboom SIM cards. I will have that website at the very top of the description. And then I will also have Amazon links to the Real Link camera and solar panel that I have so you guys can get the same setup if you'd like. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope that you guys, uh, once again, enjoyed this one. If you want to come hunt at the Real McCoy Ranch, all that information will be down in the description below as well. There's ways to contact me down there. We'd love to have you. We're going to have an amazing season. we got uh, quite a few openings this year, and we've got more animals than we've ever had. And so you guys want to come uh, take advantage of that. Come spend the weekend with me as your guide and as your cameraman. I promise you we'll have a blast, and we'll see a ton of animals and have a lot of great opportunities at some quality animals. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in just a few days. Try to catch me howling at the moon.